Hi everybody! So now I'm actually going to read this story to you, Green, by Laura Vaccaro Seeger. Where do you think this story happens? What do you think its setting is? We can't really tell much from the cover other than we know it must be about things that are green, right? Or something that is green. Green happens to be one of my favorite colors. So I'm going to go ahead and read this to you. Green by Laura Vaccaro Seeger. Green. Forest green. That was very close. You see the white rabbit in the green forest? Sea green. Sea turtle in the green water. Lime green. Do you like limes? Kind of like lemons. Pea green. Hmm. Do you like peas? Green. And look who is peeking out from the green at you on these pages. Green. Who is camouflaged here? Fern green. Ferns are a beautiful plant. They grow in the forest. Wacky green. Who ever heard of a zebra with green stripes? It's pretty wacky. Slow green. Do you see what's slow on this page? That's green also. Faded green. Sometimes colors fade when they're out in the bright light for too long. Glow green. Shaded green. Boy sitting in the shade of the tree again. All green. All different kinds of green. Do you have any idea how many different shades of green there are? I don't. On these two pages alone, I counted 32 shades of green. Some dark, some light, some of them with a little brown mixed in or a little yellow mixed in. Lots of greens. Never green. Stop sign is never green, is it? It's always red. I want to catch the driver's eyes. No green. No words on these two pages, but we can see what this boy is doing. Looks like he's planting possibly a tree, possibly a flower. see the barn over here in the background a little bit. And then just like in the book The Giving Tree, I'm wondering if this boy grows up and becomes this man with his own child. It says forever green. And we see a tree that's all grown up and we also see the red barn in the, in the background. Forever green. The end. So today, for our writing, I would like you to think about what uh, your favorite color is, or one of your favorite colors, and I will post it on the activities, um, but you're going to be writing about that color and things that are that color. So if I was going to pick another color, I'd probably say purple, and I love purple clothes, I love purple hair. I love purple jewelry. Those are just some ideas. All right, guys, have a wonderful day. Love you. Bye.